type python sets set dot discard remove and pop remove x this operation removes element x from the set if uh, element x does not exist it raises a key error discard x also does the same function as uh, remove x but if element x does not exist it will not raise a key error then we have pop function pop removes and uh, returns an arbitrary element from the set if there are no elements to remove it raises a key error now the task is we have a non empty set s and you have to execute n commands given in n lines the command will be pop remove and discard okay so we are getting uh, the input uh, on the first line which uh, defines the number of elements in the set and we are also getting uh, that input as well so let's go from the third line again the third line defines uh, the number of uh, commands that we will be passing so i'll define the variable as number of uh, commands which is equal to input and of course it will be in string format so i'll type cast it to integer now we will look through this uh, number of uh, commands and we will take the input so for item in range of number of commands we will take uh, the command which is equal to again we are taking uh, the input and the input it's in a single line so we will split it using the split function dot split okay so for now that's enough let's uh, check for the command now if command now this input dot split will split this uh, command into items in um, a list okay so the first item in the list will correspond to the command and the second item in the list will be the argument for that command so if command of uh, zero that is the first item in the list is equal to pop yeah of course it's in string then we will do a s dot pop function and pop function does not take any argument so we do not have to worry about uh, the arguments here now we'll do the same thing for uh, the remaining commands as well okay and uh, the second one is uh, remove so let me pass uh, remove here but uh, this time remove takes an argument so the argument will be the second item in the list so i'll pass uh, the second item command of uh, one Okay. and uh, this one will be in uh, string format so i'll type cast it to integer okay so that's uh, for remove we'll do the same for discard as well let me copy and paste the discard here okay now we got uh, the input and we have processed the input now we need to print the sum of uh, uh, the remaining items in the uh, set so let me declare a variable total which is equal to zero now for item in s total is equal to total this item and we will print the total i guess that's it let's run the code yeah so it passed the initial test case let me submit the code and it passed the remaining test cases as well 
so that's the solution if you like the video hit the like button and if you like the content subscribe to the channel thank you